the fuck is this fucking penguin bullshit? What the fuck is this baby ass game? Is this guy fucking T AI TTS? Does this not sound like something my TTS would say? Listen to him. One year of misery. I hereby proclaim this day the start of Pokemon Friendship Week. Tim Goodman. Pikachu. You two are the ideal detective duo. Did he say Rhyme City? Am I high right now? Uh, so much for my coffee. Something tells me. I feel like I'm high. A light roast today, huh? <laughs> The t the a it doesn't match at all. What? Does anyone else feel high? What is going on? Based on our deductions, the culprit is clear, isn't it? A bolt of brilliance. The name's Pikachu, and I'm what you might call a great detective. That felt like it was out of PlayStation I 1. Wish somebody would bring me some coffee. That was Detective Pikachu. Are you fucking kidding me? We're playing that. Two returns. Looks like he still Looks good. coffee. What cases will Tim and this tough talking Pikachu Wow, that together? is insane that this is a 2023 game. They're putting this out Next, in 2023. Take a look at this. That's literally just hey you fucking Pikachu with the voice changer. Yo. Wow. She looks terrifying. Nice. I can see Soda Pop and playing this on Sushi Show Saturday. Mario RPG Pac Man. It's cool, but. It's kind of scary that this is the most exciting thing of the Nintendo Direct. Like, it looks it looks great, but, like, why is this the most exciting thing? It's not? Okay. I mean, I'm all for remakes like this. Where are you going when, when Twitch falls apart? Uh, originally released. Chad, you want to get food afterwards? Super Mario RPG returns with brand new graphics. Whether you played the original game or not, why not take the opportunity to? Yeah, we'll probably go get food or something. RPG in the Mario series. Mr. Koizumi, that last trailer featured Mario. All right, if Twitch ever goes down, I will. Everyone that shows up, I will go to a subway and I will buy you all six inch subway sandwiches. But he's not the only one getting a game. Huh? What do you mean? Let's take it'll be an, it'll be a Mizkif meetup. Bring deodorant. What is this? That's right. Princess Peach will star as the main character in a brand new game. Oh. When she steps on this particular spot on stage. Huh? Love you, miss you Whoa. the best. 
What on earth is happening? That's all we'll show for now. No, I like that. Details at a later date. Mr. Koizumi, there's actually something else. What? New Nintendo games, let's go. Luigi's Mansion? Four? A visually enhanced version of Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, originally released on Nintendo oh. 3DS, is in development. We hope you look forward to seeing more of Luigi's ghostly antics. That's not bad. Both games will launch next year. Mario, Princess Peach, and Luigi. Looks like Mario fans have a lot of games to look forward to. More details will be shared in the future. I'm skipping anything that's that weeb shit, by the way. Anything with the sword, I'm skipping. Become Gotham City's You're out of here. In the Don't give a flying Florida. fuck. Keep that off my Nintendo system. Is all that stands what the f- Bridges that certain death. This adaptation of the hit board game features turn based card battles with RPG elements, unleash deadly combos, and bring doom upon your foes. But beware, exhaustion is close. Keep the dance party going. Oh, god, no time for bad news. No time for I literally only think of Amaranth when I think of this game. One day, a once peaceful realm was silenced by its king. Now, seven wordless warriors will rise. In this oh action, my RPG, fucking god. These heroes bound by fate must work together to explore the abyss and find the secluded king. However, yo, Nintendo dungeons and powerful foes, conquering the abyss will be no easy feat. Wield weapons like swords. Bows, I feel like I'm watching the game expo. And more <laughs> to survive this deadly chasm. And it's After Nintendo Direct. To base, materials you've collected. Hey, big like, does anyone else feel like we're watching the game expo? Like, hey, I'm an indie dev. I just started. I, you know. Into the abyss will enable you to grow stronger <laughs> and dive deeper. Add us on your wish list. This is Pogger's my Your Keith guide Hines. on this journey is the kingdom's sorrowful princess, encased in a crystal of her own tears. And through a mysterious power, her voice reverberates in the hearts of the silent warriors. Why did the king Try steal hard. the world's words? And what awaits the warriors in the depths of the abyss? Silent Anything with a sword is just bad. We all know Nintendo it. Switch, October 3rd. Okay. Yo. Yep. Sparks will fly in these Nintendo Switch games. Cast spells and cultivate your best life in Fae Farm. Wait. Make use of magic to complete tasks Kosu and game. fend off mischievous foes. Enrich your farm to help your character flourish. Decorate your space to improve your stats for the day ahead. Animal Crossing. And enchant your friends locally or online in four-player co-op. Yo! Launches as a console exclusive on Nintendo Switch September 8th. Pre-orders, including an in-game bonus, are available now on Nintendo eShop. There's about 12,000 of those. Wild racing action yeah. with Hot Wheels Unleashed 2 Turbocharged. Did you guys have the Hot Wheels game in a, a, for the PC like 20 years ago? Did you guys have that? That was a sick game. The Hot Wheels game. I used to play the shit out of that. Choose from over 130 vehicles. It literally tells you if you want to skip. Outrageous stunts to avoid obstacles. Find shortcuts. Nah, it's and good. Knock your rivals out of the way. Unleash your creativity by modifying your vehicles and building your own tracks. Oh, that's Race cool. Locally with friends in split screen co-op. Plus, up to 12 players can hit the track online. Grab the wheel when this game speeds onto the Nintendo Switch system October 19th. Get your chassis looking classy in Manic Mechanics. Grab I feel like all these games are like they're on 480p, but it's 1080p. And toss it over. 
repair vehicles quickly to earn points in solo play or four player co-op okay that's Watch cool treacherous pits pesky ufos and other workplace hazards manic mechanics launches first for consoles on nintendo switch july 13th pre-orders begin today on nintendo eShop. introducing the second paid dlc oh my fucking god come on nintendo no integrity nowadays Monsters roam the land. And now a Dark Prince. You intend to take arms against me? Nintendo. Oh my god. On a quest for revenge. I feel like we saw this game already. You are now cursed. What are those graphics? This is a mobile game. It's a mobile game. What the? It's so bad. To become a monster wrangler. I can't care. I don't care if it's Dragon Quest. It looks like shit. Sorry. Oh! Welcome to the Rescue Corps. As its newest recruit, you'll venture to a mysterious planet with all sorts of life forms. There, Ooh. you'll meet plant like creatures called Pikmin. Pigman. And the adorable rescue pup, Ochi. Good boy. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, repair the damaged Rescue Corps spaceship and save any castaways you find. All right, let's explore together. Okay. Once plucked, Pikmin are ready for action. Blow your whistle to gather them and have them Love follow you. you. Yeah, we, we, we know. Throw your little buds at things, and they'll start working for you. Ochi will also prove to be a great canine companion. He can carry items with Pikmin. Now that's cute. Or smash obstacles in your way. And if you need a flotation device, well... Yo. There you go. Oh, that's cute. Ochi can even stand up to the wildest creatures. Collect lots of treasures scattered around the planet to fix the spaceship's radar and Game Boy SP was my favorite Game Boy. Explore. Exploration isn't limited to the surface though. Why not take the plunge underground? Here, a completely different environment awaits. Oh, that's cool. Unusual Looks like more creative uh, versions of the game. Native creatures. Oh shit. And even more treasures are around every corner. You might unexpectedly find some castaways, too. Hey, wait a minute. This leafy individual just nabbed the castaway. You've got to stop him. Oh, shit, an enemy. It's time for a Dandori battle. Embrace the art of Dandori what? by strategically issuing commands to your Pikmin and Ochi. Collect more objects than your opponent within the time limit to win and save the castaway. It's PvP! That's kind of cool! Yo. By rescuing castaways, you'll be able to do more activities back at base camp, which oh, is that's right nice. next to your spaceship. Train Ochi and teach him new skills. Oh, that's kind of cool! Or build new equipment and items to help make exploration more manageable. Now that's cool, chap. For the first time in the Pikmin series, you can eventually set out for night expeditions. But there's a catch. Nightfall sends creatures into a frenzy, so stay alert. Thankfully, you'll come across the new Glow Pikmin, which only appear at night. Oh, whoa. Find luminols that produce valuable glow sap. These mounds also attract various wildlife. So use glow pigment to drive them away and protect the luminols. Many more surprises await on this uncharted planet. Oh, that was a cool level. Pikmin and Ochi by your side. No challenge Yo. is too big or too small. 
Pikmin 4. Pikmin's one of my favorite games of all time. In past Pikmin games, you had to return to your spaceship before... I actually thought that looked good. I, I think that Pikmin 3 wasn't super interesting to me, but I think that one looks way more interesting with the abilities and levels up and uh, PvP stuff. I thought that looked good. For sundown. However, in this latest day, I also like the ghost character. Out at night. We hope you can lead the Pikmin on your expedition. You're pretty goated. We have even more I know. news to share. <laughs> HD versions of the first two Pikmin games, originally released on Nintendo GameCube, will launch on Nintendo eShop later today. Yes! Plus, ahead of the game. Dude, Pikmin yeah. 2 is so expensive on eBay. It's like $80. It's so expensive. I'm so glad. Finally. A demo of Pikmin 4 will be available on Nintendo. I will play that on Rumble 100%. 100%, boys. The demo can be enjoyed even if you've never played a game in the Pikmin series before. So we hope you'll try it out when it releases. Okay, let's see a few more headlines. Why haven't they released motherfucking Super Smash Brothers on the original Pointless. on the that's that's all I'm looking for out of the Nintendo games. Give me Super Smash and give me Goldeneye. Those are the last two games that I truly do want to see on the Switch. Give me those two games. They have not done it. No, I want Super Smash Brothers the original. Yo. The original. Wait, they reached the original? Yes, they have. Oh, not Golden Yeah, Goldeneye is out. I want Super Smash Brothers now. What's this? The renowned series of stealth action games is infiltrating Nintendo Switch as Metal Gear Solid. Is there anything else that's good, chat? In volume one, this compilation includes Mario Kart 8. Into... Okay, we'll go to the Mario Kart 8. Racing into Wave Five of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. Introducing that's the DS course, right? Sprint. More characters yeah. are also being added from Mario. PD Piranha. PD Piranha. It did not feel the same without PD boys. From Mario Kart 7, Vigla. And from Mario Kart Tour, Comet. Oh, I don't care about that. Wave 5 of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game zooms onto Nintendo Switch this summer. Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. Sick. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. Two worlds, one fateful encounter. A uh, yeah, we're, of the ooh, WarioWare? Wario style. Get ready for more micro game mayhem in the latest WarioWare game. Hold two Joy-Con controllers, then action! Move your body to take on a flurry of lightning-fast micro-games. What you do and how you move depends on the micro-game. If the goddamn joysticks on the Switch were good, then I honestly think the Switch would be like a 9 out of 10 console. But it goes to like a 7 Yo, because the joysticks are just that bad. They're so bad. Act quickly with the right movement and Like this looks cool. Wait, yo? This looks cool, but I know that they're finicky. You'll be on the road to victory. Excellent! If you've got two pairs of controllers, play with a friend in local co-op. Sync up your actions to beat each micro game. Plus, up to four players can live it up across various mini-games in party mode. For example, this dicey board game is gonna keep you on your toes. I love WarioWare. Get your body moving in over 200 lightning fast micro games. In WarioWare, move it. Launching on the Nintendo Switch system November 3rd. Pre orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. What's this? Onward and upward. New Super Mario Brothers?
You're on shrooms. Oh my god. You're on shrooms! Oh, that's not shrooms. That's LSD. Yeah, you're on LSD at this point. Wait, this looks crazy. Oh my god! Uh. Yeah. Yo, chat, this looks good. Oh, Daisy's in it, finally. Bro, I hate that Nintendo has gotten away from... They only do this, like, the same four characters. It's Peach, Mario, Luigi, like, Toad. I Why don't they bring Birdo? They need to bring Daisy. They need to bring other characters. It just... I'm tired of it just being the Mario show. They need to bring back the OGs. Like... The, where's Daisy been for 10 years? Rosalina. The Waluigi RPG. Now that looks really good. Oh shit, that's soon. Ah, that's so good. That was the brand new 2D side scrolling Mario game. Super Mario Brothers Wonder. When you touch a wonder flower, expect the unexpected. The ground could start moving, or you might turn it into something different, for example. That is so cool. There were also flowers talking. Daisy is playable. And Mario became an elephant at the end. A lot of things happened. We'll share more details in the future, so we hope you'll look forward to it. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct.